The 2019 edition of the National Science and Maths Quiz and Science Festival started with a launch event, which was graced by many dignitaries, among which were stakeholders, government officials, sponsors and potential sponsors. At the launch, the new NSMQ trophy was unveiled. The new preliminary stage quiz mistress, Dr. Thelma Ohini Ajayi, a lecturer at the School of Pharmacy, was also introduced. The journey to the finals began when the students started arriving, each one of them with a win in mind, and right from day one, the whole camp was filled with sounds of bells as the students practiced in preparation for their contest. The SciTech Fair, which is one of the satellite events, followed right after the students settled in camp. The two-day event saw over 35 interesting projects on display from both junior and senior high schools across the country, as well as some tech startups, tertiary institutions and organizations. As part of the activities of the fair, representatives from Soronko Academy, a software and development powerhouse, organized a workshop to equip the students with coding skills. That aside, there was an experiential stand where some of the students were made to conduct simple experiments under supervision. The two-day event was climaxed with presentation of certificates and awards where all the participants of the fair received certificates of participation and eight schools awards for having outstanding projects. The fair was a huge success and this was made possible by Goyle, the sole sponsor of the event. The mentorship session, which is also one of the satellite events of the NSMQ, intended among other things provide an opportunity for the students to have a personal interaction with some prominent individuals in the field of science and technology was held every morning from June 18th to July 6th, 2019. Among some of the highly accomplished personalities who mentored the students were Dr. Ayram Schwenger, a lecturer at the Department of Mathematics, University of Ghana, Ms. Lois Damte, a STEM advocate, Dr. Jean Arabayangsen in Sia, the CEO of HealthWise Medical Center, and Dr. Samson Ampofokrantin, an obstetrician and gynecologist at the Medifem Water Specialist Hospital and Facility Center. The mentorship session was also made possible by Goyle, whose managing director had the opportunity to mentor the students. The picnic and tours, two of the innovative add-ons that were introduced in 2017, were largely patronized. The third edition of the picnic came off on June 23rd at the main field of the University of Ghana, Ligon. This was a time for students to take a breather from the competition to de-stress and to freshen up for the grueling task that was ahead of them. The tours offered the students the opportunity to visit centers of scientific activity, including the premises of sponsors, to enable them see science as applied in business research and industry. Among the places the students visited were NS Chemists, Cocoa Processing Company, Blue Skies and Accra College of Medicine. Next was a balloting exercise for the preliminary stage of the competition, where all 108 schools that qualified from the regional competitions balloted to compete against each other. The schools sealed their own fates that day with their own ballots. The race to the championship started on June 17, 2019, with a preliminary stage of the competition. A Pump Senior High School walked into the first preliminary stage with a gallant gait. They were absolutely unstoppable, and at the end of the contest, had accumulated 62 points with their contenders, Winiba Senior High School and Dabuasi Senior High Technical School, ending the contest with 25 and 5 points respectively. After two years of struggling to make it to the national championship, one-time NSMQ champions since Augustine's College were clearly not going to give any chances. Calm and composed, yet working at lightning speed, they picked all but one of the speed race questions and were the first school to get a Prudential Life NSMQ star at the preliminary stage, a cash prize given to the school that made a perfect score of 10 in round 3, problem of the day. The other schools that won the Prudential Life NSMQ star at the preliminary stage were Bonpansom Senior High School, Laboni Senior High School, Ascent State College, 
Awudome Senior High School and Presby Senior High School Bechim. One exciting contest at the preliminary stage was the one that featured Notre Dame Girls Senior High School, Uthman Benafan Islamic Senior High School and Adaku Senior High School. The girls from Notre Dame had an enviable fighting spirit. At the end of the first round, the girls were trailing in third place with 7 points, with Uthman Benafan Islamic School in first place with 16 points. Round after round, the girls slowly bridged the gap, and at the end of the fourth round, were in the lead with 30 points, with Uthman Benafan in second place with 18 points, and at the Kusina High School, third place with 13 points. Regardless of the slow starts, Notre Dame Girls Senior High School won the contest with a whopping 18 point margin. Another exciting contest at the preliminary stage was the one that had Asamankese Senior High School, Carpoint Senior High School, and Sredjo Senior High School. Being the last contest, all three schools were not fighting for just a win, but for enough points to make it as one of the 18 highest scoring losing schools in case of a loss. At the end of the contest, Asamankes Senior High School won with 54 points, with Carpoint Senior High School and Sredjo Senior High School losing with 33 and 32 points respectively. Nonetheless, their efforts did not go to waste, as both Carpoint Senior High School and Sredjo Senior High School made it to the 1A stage of the competition as one of the 18 highest scoring losing schools. Tensions were high when after the last preliminary contest, three schools, Nifa Senior High School, Northern School of Business and TIMAS Ekumfi were tied at 31 points. It took three tiebreaker questions to determine a winner, Northern School of Business, to progress to the next stage of the competition. Northern School of Business. Day. That is correct. The 27 seeded schools joined the race at the one day stage of the competition, but unfortunately, this was the end of the journey for many of them. Out of the 27 schools, only 10 were able to progress to the quarterfinals. Among the 17 that lost their seed were Kufuruja Senior High Technical School, Archbishop Potter Girls Senior High School, Holy Child School, New Draven Senior High School, St. Thomas Aquinas Senior High School, San Dimas Senior High Technical School, St. Louis Senior High School, Kobo Girls Senior High School, and Maoli School. The rest are West Africa Senior High School, first runner-up of NSMQ 2018, Kumasi Senior High Technical School, Ghana National College, Islamic Senior High School, Ibri Girls Senior High School, St. Margaret Mary Senior High School, KNUS Senior High School, and Infantipim School. One of the much-anticipated contests at the 1A stage was a central regional derby that features St. Augustine's College, Infantipim School, and Sredjo Senior High School. Infantipim School was definitely not ready to lose their seed and start from the regionals, and St. Augustine's College, on the other hand, had come into the competition with a different game plan. And thus, Infantipim School was no match for them. At the end of the contest, St. Augustine's College had won by 58 points, with Infantipim School in second place with 38 points, and Sredjo Senior High School, third place with 10 points. Yes, Newton. Octet. You are right. <laughs> Another contest that caused a stare and saw contenders on tenterhooks was the one that featured Anglican Senior High School Kumasi, Obokuwari School and Osei Chirichi Senior High School. Considering their excellent performance at the preliminary stage, Anglican Senior High School Kumasi were tipped by many to win this contest. The second year students were unrelenting, giving Obokuwari School a hard time in the contest. Yes, Wilfred. You're right. <laughs> Alas, fate was not on their side, yes, as Anglican you. Senior High School placed second to Opokuwari School, but with a very impressive score, 51 points. Hopefully, the second year students will bounce back fiercer next year as final year students. The 1A stage saw all the girls' schools but Wesley Girls High School exiting the competition. In Wesley Girls High School's contest with Ibraman Itikuma Senior High School and Akumuman Senior High School, the girls' performance was admirable, winning the contest with 55 points, leaving their contenders at Kuruman Senior High School in second place with 24 points, and Brahman Itikuma Senior High School in third place with 19 You're points. Right. 
at the Wami stage, only Opoku Wari School and St. Ignatius of Loyola Senior High School won the Prudential Life NSMQ star. At this stage, the cash prize was worth 2,400 Ghana cities. The quarter-final stage recorded some very electrifying clashes that saw the men being separated from the boys. The Northern Star, Tamale Senior High School, was pleasing to watch. In their contest with St. Augustine's College and Buampunsem Senior High School, Tamale Senior High School put up a very impressive performance, ending the first and second rounds in the lead. After the fourth round, both St. Augustine's College and Tamale Senior High School were at par with 45 points each. The last round was what determined the winner, St. Augustine's College, when they picked all the riddles in the round. Yes. At Shimosa School, although lost their contest, was the only school that ended Prudential Life NSMQ star at the quarter-final stage, hence bowed out of the competition with a cool 2,800 Ghana cities for making a perfect score of 10 in the problem of the day. The battle got fiercer at the semi-final stage as each of the schools craved for a win to make it to the grand finale. At the end of the day, St. Augustine's College, St. Peter's Senior High School and Presbyterian Boys Senior High School Ligon emerged as winners of their respective contests and you would definitely not want to miss this clash at the grand finale for all the tea in China. The 2019 edition of the National Science and Maths Quiz and Science Festival is sponsored by the Ghana Education Service with supports from Goyle, GCB Bank, Prudential Life Insurance Ghana, Academic City College, Vimto, Adansi Travels, Kenya Airways, Medifair Multi-Specialist Hospital and Fertility Center, Accra College of Medicine, Aachen University, Central University, Newmont Gold Corp Ghana, Enter Varsity, Adicion.store, GTP, Hottie Makeup, Shikas Beats, and Pink Pearl. Our media partners are Joy News, Joy FM, YFM, Class FM, and Radio Universe.